Right. The 2nd of February 2018, 16 hours 55 minutes and 28 seconds update. The 2nd of February 2018, 17 hours 11 minutes and 8 seconds. The U.S. State Department has reaffirmed Washington's maximum pressure policy on North Korea. Spokeswoman Heather Nowit relayed the U.S. stance during a news briefing on Thursday when asked about the controversial notion of U.S. President Donald Trump's bloody nose strike on the North as a way of ridding the regime of nuclear weapons. Now it said there is no change in the U.S. policy toward the North, adding the Trump administration has sought the denuclearization of the Korean Peninsula since its launch. The spokeswoman, however, said the U.S. prefers a diplomatic approach, referring to discussions on strengthening diplomatic solutions at a meeting of foreign ministers in Vancouver last month, including U.S. State Secretary Rex Tillerson. Washington recently withdrew the nomination of Victor Cha as U.S. ambassador to South Korea, with his opposing view to the bloody nose strategy reported to be among the reasons behind the decision.